Hey everyone, journey with me to a galaxy far, far away as we look back at the expanded universe, which filled our imaginations and kept the Star Wars franchise alive for decades before the likes of Rey and Kylo Ren debuted on the big screen. Journey with me into the Legends of Star Wars. In the time of greatest despair, a child shall be born who will destroy the Sith and bring balance to the Force. So says the ancient prophecy of the Jedi Chosen One, but there exists a different prophecy which foretells of a perfect being free of all limitations which will rise to destroy the Sith, in turn making them more powerful than ever before. This prophecy foretells the coming of the Sithari. The origin for the prophecy of the Sithari can be traced back to the earliest histories of the first Sith Empire, to the days of King Attis, a fierce Sith warrior who united the Sith race during his 300 year reign, which earned him the title Sithari, or Overlord. Attis' reign would end when he lost his life forcing the Rakuten of the Infinite Empire off Korriban. Despite Attis' death, the legend of the Sithari would live on. The priest sect of the Sith race, known as the Kisai, would preserve the legend of the Sithari throughout the millennia, passing it down in spoken form considering the prophecy too sacred to be put into writing. When exiled Dark Jedi arrived on Korriban after the Second Great Schism, proclaiming themselves Dark Lords of the Sith, Sorza Sin first put the prophecy into written form as such. The Sithari will be free of limits. The Sithari will lead the Sith and destroy them. The Sithari will raise the Sith from death and make them stronger than ever before. Many would claim the title over the millennia. In fact, most prominent Sith Lords believed themselves to be the Sithari. Darth Sidious even believed himself to be the perfect being referred to in the prophecy upon the murder of his own master, Darth Plagueis. Plagueis, being a Sith Lord of logic and science, did not believe in the Sithari himself, but saw no reason not to claim the mantle, should the robes fit. However, the individual who most closely aligned with the prophecy of the Sithari was a boy named Dessel from the mining world of Apatros. Dessel would join the Sith Brotherhood of Darkness as a foot soldier, before being admitted into the Sith Academy on Korriban, taking the name Bane and rising through the ranks. Bane would become disillusioned with the Brotherhood of Darkness, under the leadership of Lord Khan, believing the squabbling and infighting of the Brotherhood was detrimental to the goals of the Sith, and that the size of the Order diluted the power of the Dark Side. With the help of a holocron possessing the knowledge of Darth Revan, Bane formulated a plot to destroy Khan's Brotherhood of Darkness, which he set into motion on the planet Rusan as the Brotherhood fought against the Jedi Order's Army of Light led by the Jedi Lord Hoth. Bane's treachery would lead to the destruction of Khan's Brotherhood, as well as the Army of Light, trapping their souls into the Valley on Rusan until unleashed by the Jedi potential Kyle Katarn over a thousand years later. After the Brotherhood's destruction, Bane would assume the title of Darth, taking a young girl named Rain as his apprentice and enacting the Rule of Two, limiting Sith numbers so there existed one master to embody power and one apprentice to crave it. With the destruction of the Brotherhood, Darth Bane cast off the shackles and limitations imposed by Khan and his order. By destroying and restructuring the order, the Sith became more powerful than ever before. Continuing through Bane's apprentice, Darth Xana, the Sith would seek wealth and influence over galactic events during their millennia in hiding, culminating in Darth Sidious's coup of the Galactic Republic and the destruction of the Jedi Order. For the full story of Darth Bane, the Sithari, read Star Wars, Path of Destruction, Rule of Two, and Dynasty of Evil by Drew Karpishin. If you want more Legends content, click the thumbs up and subscribe buttons, and share this video so the knowledge gets out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all for the next Legend.